How are you doing tonight? I'm doing fine. How are you? Good. I'm Garrett. I'm the civil or I am the greeting officer on duty tonight. Um, I'm going to stamp your wrist if you don't mind, and that's what we're going to use to keep track of you through the assessment. The office does not open until five, so if you don't mind waiting in the waiting room right over there, 114, we'll call you back when we're ready. Okay. Bien, he empezado la experiencia, me han marcado el número, yo soy el número 112, y aquí estoy en la sala de espera para empezar el performance. 112. I'm the Civil Presence Officer, and today I'll be conducting a Civil Presence um, assessment. And to start, um, I will issue a Civil Presence tag. Um, would you prefer English or Spanish? All right, and I'll sort of instruct you as to what you need to fill out. Um, so the first thing you need to fill out is at the very top right over here is the date of birth and um, right underneath it says alien status and you just check yes or no. Um, next you will just put your entire name, um, your location of birth and current residence and down at the bottom where you see the map um, just put a number one to indicate your birth location and number mm -hmm. two to indicate your residence and just let me know if you have any questions. taking your tag with you mm -hmm. and if you don't mind sitting over there as the examination officer will be right with you. Thank you. Number 108, are you ready? Would you like to come with me? Oh, you're 112. I'm so sorry I got your number incorrect. Would you like to come with me? Yes. Awesome. I'll go ahead and take your tag. Okay, Raphael. Raphael, do you happen to have um, a valid ID on you? Um, I have this. Oh, you have I this. Oh, let's <laughs> see. Yeah, un mm -hmm. oh, and due to fraudulent activity, oh. we can't accept that anymore. I'm sorry. Do you have anything else on you? No, unfortunately, I don't. Oh, well, that's okay. We'll let someone else vouch for you. I, I think there might be some other family members of yours around. Okay, um, so do you mind if I take uh, some physical presence measurements this no, evening? No, that's fine. Okay, so I'm going to have you step into this box and face the wall for me. Pick which box you want. Um, face the wall. There you go. And I'm just going to take the, the first measurements I'll take of, are of your shoulders, okay? Mm -hmm. So from here, right to left. There we go. And then you want to bring your hands behind your back for me, wrists together. There you go. I'm just going to come behind your hands under here. And just take a little measurement right here. Okay, there we go. Looking good. And then you can turn around for me and face me if you don't mind. Yep. Okay, and then bring your right hand up. And I'm uh, solemnly swear, you know, uh -huh. like in a courtroom. Okay, and I'm going to measure from your fingertip to your elbow. Okay? Okay. Here we go. Same here. Yep. That's looking right. Mm -hmm. And bring that across your heart, uh, Pledge of Allegiance style. Yep. Have you done that recently? Yes. You have. Oh, okay. I'm going to measure from your forehead to your heart, okay? Right. From your head to your heart. There you go. This is a very important measurement. Okay, yep, that's exactly what I thought. Okay, you go ahead and have a seat. Oh, excuse me, I'm hitting my scale. Let me just go ahead and fill these measurements in. Okay, and how tall are you? I am five foot five. Five, five. Okay, and what is your eye color? Brown. Brown. Okay, here we go. Okay. Um, so let me just make sure I've filled everything out here. Okay. And so, um, uh, unfortunately, I'm going to have to explain to you that I'm detecting a little bit of absence within you this evening. Mm -hmm. I don't want you to worry. That's very common. I'm seeing that. Um, but I do have to stamp your card with absence because for my uh, co-workers that you'll be working with later, they just need to make sure that they update your records. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and stamp. Whoop. Get my ink going here. Yeah. 
and indicate your sense of absence. But we're going to go ahead and update that in the future uh, once we get through the evening. Let's see here. Okay. So, um, but I don't, you know, I don't want you to worry. As I said earlier, it's very common because, you know, as you know, you live in the United States of America, right? Uh -huh. This is the land of opportunity. You can have whatever job you want, even at 13 years old. Um, you can make as much money as you like. You can buy a house at some point if you want to. Maybe you can take a cruise around the world. It's totally up to you, right? It's all there. We just need you to practice a little bit more presence in society, okay? Just be a little bit more ambitious, but not too ambitious. Um, and we have, we have a couple of tips. Um, the first tip is we need you to speak our language. Okay, because you know, it's just we want people to feel comfortable around you. Um, so you might want to speak more of the dominant language that you hear rather than any other language you might. Um, be your first language that you know. Um, also, if you have any cultural beliefs that are different from the norm, you might want to just keep those to yourself. You know, I understand. You understand? We kind of just, you know, want you to be kind of like a sheep and like go with the flow with other people. Right. Yes. You know, but we're happy you're here. I don't want you, to, want you to get that wrong. You know, we want you to be here, but just not make other people feel uncomfortable. Got it? Okay, yes, I got okay. it. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to give you an opportunity to write a statement of presence um, in regards to what your... Um, this is assessment, the absence that I've, I've found within you this evening. Uh -huh. um, and so we'll take you to the Office of Reflection and let the Reflection Officer help you do that, okay? Okay. Okay, let's go. You follow me. Come in here. This is the Office of Reflection. This is the Reflection Officer on duty. Hi, how, how are, are you? you? I'm doing fine. Here you go. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and hand you your security blanket. Uh -huh. And then please feel free to have a seat. Uh, what we need you to do here is just write out your statement of presence or any kind of thoughts or feelings that you've been having throughout this experience or in regards to any late events, current events going on right now. Um, and then a processing officer will be in to take your tag and help you process your statement when you're ready. Let me know if you have any questions also. Uh, may I borrow a pen? Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. So you, do you want me to state how present I feel? It's up to you, honestly. There's no wrong answer here, so you can go ahead and fill out any kind of thoughts you might be having or your what the word present might mean to you, anything like that. So whatever popped in your head when I was talking to you. Okay. Yeah. Ahora voy a llenar una hoja y donde yo voy a escribir qué tan presente yo me siento en este pueblo. Our staff has marked your civil presence status as absence and that you have written a statement here. Um, will you please read it aloud? Yes. I feel that I am present in the town of Boone for I go to school. I have a YouTube channel and people have come to know me around town. I mean, I, I think I feel pretty present here. Is there anything else that you would like to add to that statement? Um, no, I think that's, um, I think that's good. Okay. All right, you. Well, now I'll just need two fingerprints from your right hand. Mm -hmm. Here's the pad. And right here is where you're going to be putting those fingerprints. Update you as your civil presence yes. changes. So my name is Rafael Vasquez. You're in North Carolina? Yes, I'm in North Carolina. Okay. 
here is your completed civil presence tag. Uh, I recommend that you wear it. There are examples, yeah, oops, that's okay. There are examples on how to wear the tag here. And that is just to display your civil presence and we will be in contact with you if it ever changes. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Now, um, let me actually take this. We're gonna keep the top portion. share your statement with mm -hmm. the other participants and I can show you exactly where you can put that statement in our okay. archives room. Mm -hmm. This is your statement. Oh, yes. Yeah, I'll take this one. You need some more? Go ahead. Okay. If not, mm -hmm. you can also go back to the lobby um, and converse with some folks in there. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Este es el cuarto de espera y veo que mucha gente, ya que pasen por el performance, os va a hacer unas preguntas para ver cuál fue su experiencia. 